Hi, I'm Zeke Peach with Electro Automatic. Today, I'm gonna to take you through a tour of our turnkey power rack solutions. Here we've got a 42U rack that's capable of hosting up to 240 kilowatts of total power. And the great thing is, is it's ready to go. Uh, you just have to connect your input wiring and output wiring. Everything else is done inside in terms of engineering and making sure that it's safe for you to use in your facility. So let's just start off with the front of the unit. Um, we've got safety circuit, uh, including a front panel uh, mushroom switch that will kill power, uh, AC power to the entire system if needed. We also have a door interlock on the back, which protects the, uh, the user from all the hazardous energies. We've got uh, eye bolts on the top of the unit in case uh, you need to lift it for some reason, either to get it out of the crate or to move it around in your facility. We've got some adjustable feet on the bottom to make it easy to roll around and also to add a break if you, for more permanent installation. We have a QR code on the front. So if you scan this, this will take you to a link for all the documents, manuals, software that's available for your system. Each door is uh, keyed uh, for safety. Inside the unit, <clears throat> you'll see that it always comes pre-wired for a full 240 kilowatts or eight of our 30 kilowatt uh, power supplies or electronic loads. Um, that includes uh, shelves for each unit. Uh, if, unit. if something will be blank, we can provide a panel to block this off so you have a nice clean look. We've got uh, AC input wiring for all the units with connectors in the back. We've got down below individual circuit breakers for each of the eight units that, um, that will be installed inside. And then we've also got a breaker for our 20 volt, 24 volt power supply that provides power to our emergency circuit. And uh, now I'll turn it around and show you the back. All right, here we are at the back of the 42U inch rack. Uh, some of the things that come with the unit are our bus bar covers. So there is a large DC uh, bus bar uh, to connect all the units in parallel. This uh, bus bar will protect um, the bus bars from someone inadvertently touching them. And then everything else that you need comes in this little cardboard box that'll come inside the unit. So again, everything's included that you need uh, in order to install the units and run them. In here you'll find a USB drive that has all of the um, manuals, software, and everything available for each of the units that's installed in the rack. Parallel cables, which include a BNC cable. This is just a standard cable. And then a Cat5 uh, Ethernet network cable. You can find these with your IT department just in case you, you need an extra one. Lastly, you'll find all of the hardware that's needed for installing the bus bar, as well as the front panel of the units uh, to install them, uh, secure them in, on the front of the rack and then any hardware that's needed for connecting the DC bus bar to the rear uh, terminals of the power supplies. So inside the rack, we've got our door interlocks up here. So just in case someone tries to open the door when the cabinet's powered on, this will prevent uh, or remove AC power from all of the units, effectively making the system um, benign and, and safe at this point to go inside. Um, your hazardous energies would be here on your DC bus bar and then down below on your AC input. So uh, some of the things that are also included to make sure that it's easy to install every power supply inside the rack are your AC input connections. They're already pre-wired with the connectors and ready to plug in. We have, again, we have shelves for each of the units that's already installed. And then the bus bar is provided allow you to connect all of the DC terminals together to parallel the units uh, for higher current and effectively higher power. The parallel cables, uh, as you can see here, BNC cable goes in between each chassis. And then we have the ethernet cable for the master uh, slave connection or communications between each unit. So down below, we've got our AC input terminal blocks. There are two of them, each one uh, needs to be set up or ready for 120 kilowatts of power. From our AC input terminals, we go to two large AC contactors inside 
Those contactors will open and close based on the emergency circuit which is the, again, the front panel switch and the do door interlock switches on the back. We have a 24 volt power supply, which gets power from this left terminal block. And that supplies the power for the emergency power or emergency circuit. From the eight contactors, we go to the individual breakers for each power supply. Uh, and these are all rated uh, breakers for uh, UL508 and NFP 79 safety, uh, safety requirements. And from the circuit breakers, we go up to the individual units or these, these uh, AC input connectors. Some of the other features, we have a, a, a bus bar here for, for common ground for all of the units, uh, including the rack and all of the panels that are inside. We've got surge suppression device down below. Uh, in case there's a, some type of lightning strike or extremely high uh, volt, voltage surge coming into the unit, this will route power uh, to, to chassis ground, protecting the units inside. And those are some of our great features of our turnkey power rack solutions. The biggest benefit is you don't have to worry about trying to engineer one of these units yourself, worrying about all the power, the, the current and the safety requirements um, that are, will be necessary to protect the user and also the devices that are connected to it. And for lower power solutions, we have a 24U rack that can host up to 120 kilowatts of power. For more information, please contact uh, sales at electroautomatic.com or visit our website at eapowered.com for more information.